Hey folks, um, how you doing? It's uh, Friday morning. Um, I'm sitting outside of Starbucks. Uh, I had a coffee in there earlier, but I didn't want to be that weirdo on the phone. Well, staring at his phone and talking, you know, and people walking thinking this guy is nuts. So I decided to vlog in my car. Anyways, plus I might say something personal. Um, anyways, uh, today's a good day. I woke up bright and early. I'm feeling a little bit better, getting better each day. Um, my throat didn't feel quite as sore when I woke up this morning. Um, I didn't cough nearly as much, so, uh, Today's going to be a good day. I'm going to CR today uh, here in Flint and uh, it's Celebrate Recovery. It's a Christ Centered Recovery Program where they uh, help you with your hurts, habits, and hang ups. Uh, today I wanted to really talk about. Um, families, relationships. Um, if you're like me, you've struggled with them just about all your life. Um, you know, uh, I remember before getting married, that I thought, you know, when I get married, I'm going to have another chance at entering into another family. And, um, and things will get better. But, you know, um, they didn't. Because I entered into a family... And, um, right off the bat, there's all sorts of problems in the relationships. And, um, even when I was dating her, you know, my wife, um, and, you know, I'm not saying it was all their fault. A great deal of it was my fault. Um. And I had problems with my own family, and um, you know, recently I know I had to forgive all these people, but it takes more than just forgiving people. You know, there's a there's a much bigger factor than just forgiving people. Because forgiving people comes naturally once this other um, thing is implemented. You know, first you gotta get your relationship right with God for your relationships to change. When your relation, when your life is right with God, your relationships will soon all change for the better um I struggled for way too long with relationships and <clears throat> the truth is is I used to judge people without realizing it I used to have problems not liking people too much. I would love them, but not like them. Uh, based on their on their own struggles and how they and how they would treat me. But the truth is, is I was a hypocrite. You know, 
I was doing the exact same thing as they were doing. They were judging me on my, um, on my problems and, you know, um, not really looking at theirs. How often are us Christians doing this, really? You know, when we deal with Christians and non-Christians, you know? But the thing is, is when we get our lives right with God, people will notice. You won't be as much of a hypocrite when your life is right with God. And people's problems with you will be far and fewer. And you will start taking on more godly-like characteristics instead of worldly characteristics. And you will be more understanding and loving on others and less judging when you become more God, when you become more Christ-like. You know, you will forgive those, truly forgive those that have hurt you. And, um, you know, it won't just be something you're telling yourself because you're a Christian, you must forgive. So I've forgiven these people and then still turn around and judge them. Anyways, um, this has worked for me. I remember one day not too long ago thinking after talking to this person that I used to have the biggest problem with um, what I thought based on how he treated me. But one thing I noticed is he treated me so much differently recently, you know, over time. And then I started thinking, you know, my mom has started treating me so much differently over time. And I could keep on counting my in-laws, my, you know, all these relationships I really struggled with have really turned around without me even completely realizing it over time. And I couldn't think of anything, any major thing that I had done except surrender more of my will to God. Um, folks, it's not easy, I know, but the two biggest things that might help you start in this direction is praying more and spending more time in God's Word. Just take baby steps and things will all start falling into place soon enough. Anyways, that's my uh, little message or topic for the day. For whatever it was worth, I hope, I hope you, you, if you're struggling with relationships, have at least thought about what I said. Um... because it worked for me I hope it can work for you too Lord I want to pray for these people who have relationships where they're struggling Lord where they're not seeing eye to eye where there's judging where there's 
um, Hertz, Lord, I pray that you come into these people's lives and work miracles. Do what they can't do themselves. And Lord, help their relationships because family is so important. Relationships are so important. We can't go about this life alone. And Lord, if we are really in you, we are acting in love, not judging and um, not hurting others for the sake of being mean. Lord, in all this I pray, in Jesus' name, amen. Folks, um, I wish you well today. I wish you a great Friday. I wish a beginning of a change in your life. In Jesus' name, amen. God bless you all. Remember, who loves you? I love you. Goodbye.